All right, welcome back to KSAN News. Temperatures have been cool throughout much of the weekend, this weekend. What we can expect moving forward? Well, we'll stay on that cool trend as we look at the weather headlines with some changes here to the Contra Valley. A cool weather setting is starting to take effect here as we go into the next couple of days. And what that means is we're going to see some changes starting tonight. We are watching our next disturbance that comes into the forecast, bringing us a chance of some rain, possibly some snow or mixing for some of us. I have a look at that and the possibility of what we could see here in across the Contra Valley in just a couple of minutes. But for January overall, man, we'll be seeing pretty much well below average, even though we did see 80s one day here on the 14th of January, staying 11 days above average. Even though we've been seeing more 70s, average is around 62 degrees around here in the Contra Valley. And right now, that cold atmosphere is starting. Now, we have some low-level clouds, but still seeing temperatures drop off, especially in the zone around 37 degrees, 45 in Sterling City, 51 in Ballinger, 49 in Melbourne, in Eden, and 46 in Wall. All of us just starting to taper off, and those clouds will start to break as we go into the next couple hours here, though. Will be great to see some cool weather and also probably get the heaters going because temperatures will be in the 40s then dropping into the 30s before warming up by 10 a.m. back to around 46 degrees for us. So we're not going to see too much of a change temperature wise here going forward. But as those clouds, there's a low off here to the west of them in Mexico and also south of Arizona and New Mexico. And that's infecting some clouds, low level clouds into our region and some moisture. Well, there's that low that I talked about here, counterclockwise flow around that. And you're already seeing that shower and that influence with that lifting and the moisture being prevalent here. Seeing some of that, and some of that will start to affect into our southern counties, especially around overnight to Monday. Into Monday, I think most of our eastern counties will get on some of the action going to Monday afternoon. But everyone won't see that much rain going forward here before things just start to clear out. A cold front will come into the Contra Valley, dropping some temperatures and also having things bring mixing to us with that lifting before we turn back into the warming trend, getting up to the upper 60s around Sunday and by the time we get to next weekend. So those are the changes that we can expect, but the moisture will return this week. That low is going to track off to the east, bringing the moisture coming back to the Contra Valley, especially around Wednesday when that mixing chance increases here making it more prominent to see it. But again, right now, models are not consistent. I'll go with a low chance right now, but this is just the potential of what we can see coming into that rain. Maybe if we see some mixing, not even reaching an inch here going into Wednesday, looking at our potential rainfall amounts here, probably around here in San Angelo, 0 0.02 inches. A little more to the south than in the northern or eastern part of the Contra Valley, but still early to tell. We'll just wait to see what develops in the next couple of days. But outside dining forecast looks something like this. Your lunch hour is going to be in the 60s, cooling off into the 50s, clearing entree. You want to have a great dinner with your family and friends. It's definitely going to be a little cooler than what you probably expected. Tonight we'll get down around 37 degrees, 20% chance. Most of us will see dry conditions. Some of us will see a little more wet, more to the southeastern and also southern county of Contra Valley. 64 is where we'll warm up tomorrow with some mostly sunny conditions. Winds will be around 5 to 10 miles per hour, a little breezy, but not gusty. We will see those winds pick back up going into the rest of next weekend, but two cold fronts come through. One bringing us a chance for some mixing, the other one dropping us down a bit come Friday. Stay where you are. We have more KSN News after this.